Hey everyone, and welcome to the channel. Today we're going to be going over how to record a guitar on Logic Pro X. So first of all, you need to make sure that you have an audio interface connected to your computer. You want to make sure that it's selected, so how you're going to do that is you're going to go to Settings, then you're going to go to Audio, and then you want to make sure your output device and your input device is whatever your audio interface is. For this purpose, you can see we're using the Scarlett Solo USB. So that's what I have selected. The next thing you're going to want to do is make sure that you have a track. So you'll click up here and click just one of the audio tracks. You can see I added one right here. And right now it's selected to input one, which is where I have my microphone plugged in. So what I want to do is I need to come down here, select here and go to input, and go to input two. Now you can see the audio when I talk is not coming through here. The next thing you want to do is make sure you have this track highlighted. Click right here so you can hear the instrument and then make sure that on your guitar it's plugged into your interface and you have it turned up on the pickups. <laughs> And now you can see there's audio coming in. If you don't have this selected, you can't hear it as well. Now, if you want to record, you do have to have this little R highlighted. So if I were to go ahead and just have this I selected, but not the R, and I go ahead and try to record, it did pick up that I was trying to record this. But sometimes if you're on a different track and you try to do that, as you can see, I'm going to delete this. And then I try to record. You can see it's going to now highlight on the other track. And now even though you can hear the guitar, it's not recording the guitar. Now this can be helpful if you're wanting to play guitar along with your singing or um, play guitar or have the guitar being played um, to a drums but not hear your vocals but you want to sing along. So there's a couple different options there. So whatever track you're selected to when you click this record button is going to start to record that track. Now if you want to do more than one, you do have to select them all and then make sure you click on these R's. So right here you can see that you can only have um, an input go to one at a time though. So this is input one and then this is input two that I have. So I have them both selected. Anyways guys, that's just a basic overview of how to record a guitar in Logic Pro X. If you did enjoy this video, please do leave a like on this video and comment down below what you'd like to see in the future. Until next time guys, keep rocking on.